Karens and Kevins are the most annoying people you could ever run into. From racial discrimination to mental breakdown to false accusations, each of these uncontrollable idiots gets instant karma. This Kevin is harassing the shop assistant at Walmart. He wants to talk to the manager, but she really doesn't want him to. Yikes, Kevin, give the poor girl a break. Don't you have anything else in your life? So I'm in Walmart on Washington Street. I asked this young lady to find me a manager. I asked this young lady to find me a manager and because I need some help, but she won't find me a manager. But I'm asking for help in the radio section. I called someone to help you. What else do you need? I asked you for a manager. Okay. And you told me you don't know who the manager is. He's insisting on a manager. He just needed help in automotive, but now he will not leave me alone. So I want to get her on camera Go ahead. so I can report that she would not even help me. I called someone where you needed. You asked I asked for a manager. You told me you don't have one. I told you I don't know who it is right now. And I asked for any manager. And you told me you don't know. And you're not really helping can me. Can you leave me alone? Yeah. Please! Stop harassing me! I'm asking for a manager. And y'all see what she's doing. So... I'm going to get her. This is help. This is Walmart's help. That's Walmart's help right there. Bald Kevin has just lost it. Not just his hair, but his tiny mind, too. He's threatening to beat up a 16-year-old girl that just mocked him for not having any hair. But he doesn't have any hair. So no matter what this girl did, this Kevin is totally out of line. Just look at him. Get the out of here. You're 40. I'm just a kid. If you weren't a kid, you know what? I'm going to knock that phone out of your hand. Are you mad? Your daddy didn't win. Are you mad? Oh, just sit back and relax, you, you dumbass. Bye. Sit back and relax. I am, sweetheart. Yeah, yeah. Bye. Yeah. I wish you were 18. I'd fucking oh, remove I your am. hand. I am Touch 19. Me. Touch me. Touch no, me. Sweetheart. Touch me. You're not worth it. Touch me. You're not worth it. Touch me. You're not worth it. Touch me. You're not worth it, baby. Touch me. Touch me. I dare you. I'll remove your yeah, head. That's provoking. Look at you know that. what? You're in my face. You're in my face. You yeah. better back off. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> Look at this little dyke. Oh, I get more than you, mother. I get so much more than you. You know what? Put your hand on me. Did I? Put your hand on me. Yeah? Have another one. <laughs> Are you mad? Let's see. Let's see your play real quick. Yeah? Yep. Get behind it. Please, get behind it. Get behind it. Bye, baby. You know what you need? You need to be removed from the gene pool because you're too f***ing stupid to be alive. Yeah? Yeah, you do. Yeah, uh, you have yeah. no hair, sweetie. Oh, baby. Touch me. Touch me. No. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. Come on. Come on, heart. Get that phone out of my f***ing face. I'm about this close. I'm about Get this f***ing close. Truck. I'm Get about this truck. How old are you? Hey, hey, shut up. You shut up. Shut up. Who's out here out of this truck? Bye, babe. This off-duty police sergeant is arguing with a construction worker that's standing in his way. This Kevin isn't even civilized. I'm respectfully asking uh, Milestone for a supervisor and they're refusing to give me one. I want your supervisor. I am a sergeant. I, I want somebody over you. I want, I want that I want a phone number. Right now. You're the one breathing all heavy for a fighter. Because he, he's starting an issue with people out in the street. He is not starting an issue. You weren't, sir, never, you weren't. That guy has never caused an issue since he's been here. First thing he, he did was, he got him first thing he right did was apologize to me. First thing he did. And why are okay. you saying he has an attitude? You do. 
You're the one with the attitude right now. I don't have to leave. Uh, well, then we're on the mouth of the street. You're not babysitting me. Now, I've been doing this longer than you can imagine. I came over to have a conversation with him. And we fixed it. Now you're over here causing more of a problem. Well, he had an attitude. I said you had an attitude. You are totally. I need a supervisor for you. No problem, buddy. You choose your battles wisely, you fellas. Already, you've already lied to me. You said you was pulling out of there. No, I didn't. I said I was right here on the turn lane. Told me you, was right there. you lying sack of shit. I said, now I was you're right here and I turn it. Now you're cussing at me. I was sitting right. He knows that. He was I hit you right here. He just told me. You know what? You're a nobody. Quit, quit, you get quit out of the street. Your, quit pointing your finger. Get out of the street. Come here. Come here. Get his tag number. 22474. I don't really care. We're getting it. I just told you. 22474. What's your badge number? Five. Five? Car five. What county? What township? Morgan. Morgan? Yep. Police station. Don't worry about it. You got my no, tag. You think no, you know everything. You think you know everything. Now, now you're trying to push me. You touch me, you're going to jail. <laughs> you see, you, you see just what well, I see. see, see right. I got it on camera. Right, what he just did. Just like your husband says, danger, stupid. You know this is street. going on YouTube, right? Get out of the street. <laughs> Unbelievable. This drunk bartender doesn't trust the military IDs of two customers. He gets so worked up that he decides to break them. See what happens? Now the cops are involved. I mean, yeah, it's a real ID. I don't understand sure what that? Dude, Dude, it's all real. Okay. Don't let me let me call my boys in the been of Afghanistan. We've been to Iraq and Afghanistan. Dude, you don't even look old enough to know about 9 11. You're so right. Get the out of my house. Get the he needs his ID. Well, yeah, you are. This one's fake. What's what are you doing, man? That's fake. Get the out of here. No, you can't. It's a fake ID. You, no, that's government property. No, it's going in the trash. Well, if it's government property, we call them in here and we'll find out if it's government property. It's a bar called? We'll find out. I don't even know. What's that? I know you're going to get military this time. Yeah, we do, but you can't scrape the. Off of yes, you, it's ID. laminate, man. Military IDs are real IDs. Whoa. They're UV protected. They're not laminate. Well, let me see yours. I will. So, let me see them. What are you talking about their ID? Um, it's destruction of government uh, property, so yeah. And you can press charges against me if you want. That's fine. I'll give you my ID. That's real. And I'll tell you exactly what my name is when the cop shows up. Did you say what his name was too? Yeah. Also, don't serve food, minors right? in my bar. Get the yeah. Do I look like a liar? You do. You do. That's great. You got your ID. Oh, wait. If you're in the military, you can just go get another one right now. It's fine. No, that's the whole process. And we're not even near a base right now. Yeah. You're not near a base? You're not near Fort Winterwood? An hour away? An hour away. It's an hour yeah, away. We're working here. Where are you working here? It's a military operation. There ain't no right. military operation in Lake Neos Arts. You Kidding me? Yeah, it's not the first time I've been here, but it's right. not the what, first time I've been here. What military operations that Lake Neosarks? Right. Thank oh, you. Man, what are you guys doing here? Some secret bullshit? I mean, it Some is, I'm protecting the dam right. from being bombed? Um, where's ID at? It's in the trash. It's gone. It's fake. Dude. Okay, hey, I do a lot of push-ups. Don't touch me. But not and make every single person dude, young. They, you're telling me that on a government ID, they have yeah, a yeah, filament yeah. on the front that you can yeah, pull off. With a chip yeah, on it, that reads. I'm with a you. chip on it? Yeah. No, dude, the chip is inside the card. You can't lie to me. It's like a passport, you dumb Have you seen a credit card? Bro. Yeah, I've it's seen a credit card. Out, yeah, but yeah, you can't you. peel the filament off of No, you can't. Peel. Peel that for all you want. It's peel that one all you want. Peel that one all you want. Peel that one all you want. Look, dude, I'm he not said, to show cards. me a credit card. I'm not trying to ruin your cards. You're right. I'm telling he you. He said, show me a credit card. It's you said you could peel these off, too. Wait, what What can you peel off? You want to peel something off of that? Here, peel peel something off of that. See if you peel Bro, something off of that. That's my social security card. Here's, I'll give you my library card. Peel something off of that. You're telling me that my Missouri ID card is more secure than a military ID? That's not secure there's no shipping. Don't worry. Don't, 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 what do you mean it's not secure there's no yeah, shipping? It's not even a contract. Yeah. What do you mean there's no security because it's not shipping? Yeah. Like, like, you're telling me that I... 
I can't peel the front off of this. How's it going, sir? How's it going? Where's the side of the air? It's in the trash. Right there. What? Are you working here? No, I am. Oh, no. Have you been in the military, sir? Yes. Can you tell me if you can peel off the front of a military ID? Oh, oh, yeah. Actually, <laughs> I remember mine being laminated, so... Has she shown you her actual ID where the birth date is raised at the bottom right corner? Her birth date is raised at the bottom right corner. He's got her. Appreciate it, man. Thanks a lot. This Karen thinks it's a great idea to threaten a cashier at a restaurant because she doesn't feel like paying the bill. She takes things to the next level by throwing food all over the shop. Class act, isn't she? Not. This Kevin is threatening a bunch of teenagers riding on skateboards. Dude, aren't you a little old to ride one? Things get a little awkward when Kevin plants a big wet kiss on one of them. What are you even up to, Kevin? Just calm down. If you think you can take this property and do what you want with it, I'll take your property and do what I want with it. You won't. That's not. You can't you want. touch a minor. Yeah. Yeah, are the rules? Fucking trash charges, dude. Oh, you're such a bunch of pussies. What the, a generation of pussies. Are the steroids fucking with fucking bunch of pussies? Give me your skateboard. Yes, Give me your skateboard. I want to do whatever I want with it because That's, I can just do what I want with other people's thing. property. This is not the same thing. It not is the same end. thing. It is. Now, this is why you're fucking the dumbest generation of fucking morons I've ever skateboarded. Ride your skateboard. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh! What are you gonna do, bro? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do, huh? He just kissed me, bro. What are you gonna do? <laughs> are you touching me over there? Yeah. Oh, he's. And I'm serious. Go, get a cop. go, go. What are you gonna you do? You go. Karens get violent too. This Karen is angry. Not only does she use racist slurs, but she slaps him too. Well done, Karen. You're a great role model to your granddaughter. Do you want her to turn into a Karen too? Take that. Okay, I don't care if you don't like my shirt. Are you really right now? I'm not saying a word. You are. No, you are. You want me to no, take my shirt off? I'm not saying a word. I'm not going to take my shirt Hi. off. Hi. 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 Have a nice day. Oh, here, Chris, you stay right here. What did you say? You heard me. You heard me. I'm just giving you're not, a no, shit. No. You stay oh, right here. Up. Stay, you. 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 You gonna say that in front of my daughter? You gonna say that in front of my daughter? Her mother's black. You don't say that. Shut up. I wish you would touch me. Shut up. Call the police. If you're ever wondering where you can meet a real life Karen, the number one place is a parking lot. This is the perfect place to lose your mind, Karen. This Karen is refusing to move her car just because she parked wrong. Everyone's got it in for poor Karen. So this is a one way parking lot that this woman is refusing. She's trying to go the wrong way down a one way and isn't moving. So how Yes, you can. You're just sitting here being a bitch. Back up and go around and pull in. Back up and go. Out of the way. You have to. You can't get out of the way. This is a one way street. I know. And and I didn't back up and go that way. way. Just back up. You I'm can like, back up. Put it in reverse and go 20 feet backwards. Get the out of the way. Of the way Move your car. Lady, this not serious. You're 
were going the wrong way on a one-way street. I didn't make an issue. You're the one going the wrong way. It wasn't that serious from the jump, you guys. Would you please? It's not that serious. My granny is in there dying, and I'm supposed to meet her in there. We are all here for someone in the emergency room. You're going the wrong way. This Kevin is just a security guard, but he's telling the neighbors to go back into their apartment. Not quite sure what this Kevin is thinking, but his power trip backfires. Check it out. You're being audio and video recorded, just so you know. Yeah. You need to go inside your apartment. I'm giving you a lawful command. Go inside your apartment. Oh, so you're police? Security for the security. property. Huh. You're security. There. No, I'm security for this property. I never seen it. Because we have a partnership with them as well. Since when? That's none of your business. Uh, actually, it is because I live here, so it is part of my business. Charles one, I'll take a supervisor. Hey, I'm up all night, dude. I've never seen you here once. We're through here all the time. No, you're not. I'm here. Yeah, we are. No, you're not. I'm up from four o'clock in the afternoon. You might drive, roll your, your car is over here, here, but you ain't never I've seen me. I've never seen a single patrol car. And there's a reason for that. Because you got the wrong bitch. Because I obey the law. You're not obeying your lease right now. We don't allow people to loiter in the parking lot. So am I not allowed to walk through my parking lot? What about you can leave and go and come back. You cannot hang out in the parking lot. You don't know what I'll do. I could have walked right through You that were fence. hanging around the fence. I had observation. Uh-huh. And? Is that illegal? You cannot hang through the fence. Actually, until she's given a trespass warning, you can't do shit. That's not true. Yes, yes actually it is. It is. It is. No, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Are you no, a cop? No, yes, it is. That's actually illegal because you haven't even given us a Morning. I told you, you to go inside your apartment, hang out on your patio. This is this a is common a, area. No, this is a this is considered a patio. No, it you isn't. You look at the fucking building, and you it look is at a the, common okay, area. You know what? Shut the fuck up and let me finish speaking. Do you want to go to jail for disorderly conduct? You know what? You can't because I'm pregnant. That's actually it's a lot because of love. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. Are you on the lease? No. She's my guest, you idiot, and you're treating my guest like. So well, I'm gonna trespass your guest, and that no, is my lawful not. right. No, you're not. Yeah, I am. She needs to go inside the apartment or she's going to jail. You, this is your final you warning. Me too, motherfucker. Huh? I said then you could arrest me too because wasn't I trespassing? You all are trespassing. I'm telling you. You cannot hang out in the common area. The only it doesn't matter. It's a common area. It doesn't matter. If it's a common area, then everyone's allowed to No, there. that's yes. not how this works. Oh, and I yes. really appreciate okay, you yelling so at my home. daughter. So is, a, is a public park a common area? Is a public park a common area? Yeah, it has curfews too. Okay. This is a common area, which means I can restrict your access to it. There is nothing in my lease that says... Yes, that. there is. Yes. Yeah, but uh -huh. you know, I, I do recognize you. Yeah, I've talked to you before. So Have I'm you ever had problems with me or my children? No. Yeah. I'm telling your did guests I, to no, go inside. My you were not child, involved over there. Actually, no, you did my us. child you said, go leave or from the property, child. the other property, yes or no? Your child was hanging on the did fence. Did she or did she not leave when asked to leave? Yes or no? No, she did not. Yes, yes she did. No, she didn't. You don't know. Why is it on? It is you on. You followed me all the way up here. Right there. Okay. You're being audio and video recorded. I've already explained that to you. Yes. Yeah, you are in a common area. You are going to go inside or I'm going to charge you with trespass. I am the supervisor. He is the second supervisor. Cool. Where's the police, dude? Okay, I'll get them for you. That's how we're going to do this. You might want to talk to your freaking haywire buddy there. I know that's, that's not on you. Because you were yelling at him, dumbass. Oh, also, he said that he was going to arrest me. Alright, so nothing's going on. No, my no, kids saw here. this. Kevin's enjoying kicking people out of places too, and why not? This Kevin is one of them. Here he is accusing an innocent woman of trespassing and taking videos of him without permission. So why would she do that? Beats me. Oh, I'm in Nordstrom right now. 
And no, I've only been there and been here for one minute, and this man is following me. You have been verbally trespassed. It is no, no, leave. you never asked me to leave. I'm you telling you never now, asked I'm not me to leave. You, I'm telling you, you, to leave. you, are you cannot tell me to leave if I didn't do nothing. I just walked in here two you minutes ago. You are and filming, which you are not legally allowed yeah. to do. You must leave the this store. This is a man. He's discriminating against me. So. He keeps saying that I'm somebody that I'm not. Make I don't even know this motherfucker. Because you are trespassed. In Nordstrom. I haven't even been here for ten minutes. I haven't been here for ten motherfucking minutes. Don't even go back and forth with him. Don't even go back and forth with him. How can you? For what? For what? What's the reason? When did we start doing that? Since from uh, well, when you were filming is illegal. Us? No, Massachusetts audio filming is absolutely illegal okay. without consent, okay. and you don't have my consent, All right. so it's illegal. Oh no. Yeah. No, yeah. and that just started yeah. just now. And you're from New York, from, so you don't know law anyways. Exactly. So, yeah. so I do. So, so who's from Peabody then? And whose faces do you have in your phone? Because I've never up. been here a day in my life. I've never been here a day in my life. All right, we're not lying here. We're not playing this game. What? We're not lying here. What? We're not making anything up. We're not making anything up. I got time for the police. I don't know what the fuck this Kevin has done one of the worst things any employee can ever do. He's lost his customer's card. Look how he refuses to apologize. You just told me that you're not fond of me as a customer because you lost my credit card. Are you going to stand by that statement? I didn't state that. You just That's said we are not no. fond of customers like you because I'm upset because you lost my credit card over a driving when we drove in to get my prescription. You then tell me that you're not fond of me as a customer. So After you lose my credit card, so, that's okay. So you think ain't that it's okay that uh, you're gonna say that we suck? Even, yes. I mean, technically, we're here for you guys. But you lost my card. That's not Human being here for error. me. Mistakes happen. Yeah, but that's that's um, that's fine. Except and then so, you turn around so and say you, it's my so fault. You're so yeah, but, talking to us about well, it. Well, because you're talking to me. Uh, yes, because uh, I'm understandably I, upset because suck? you lost my credit card. It's like like I mean. What do you literally want us to do? We went outside. Find my it? credit card? We were we went or, outside. Or give us we, some kind of. Yeah, uh, but you're, we were saying just, we suck and everything we, else. So we if were I was just about to leave, no. and you yelled over the aisle and said, We because don't like customers like you. Like, like that. that. Okay. Like so, that. But, who get upset when you lose a credit card? Because, you don't I mean, like customers we, who get we upset. We're already <laughs> going to. Because I can almost guarantee. Go through all that, that process. If I want to say nothing, here, you guys would have continued walking. stating. Oh, we're definitely going to continue to state it. We're going to make sure everyone knows that this this Walgreens is not the best place to go because you lose our credit card. So yes, I was upset, and I have every right to be upset. We drive in the drive-in. We're late at night. We're hungry. I just want my prescription. I didn't expect to have to go home now, cancel a credit card, and try to get a new one because you lost it. I understand human error. I just don't understand why. You have to yell back at me and say, we are not fond of customers like you. Let yeah. me be upset not during like this you, moment. Like that. Let me be upset that. in the fact that you lost something not of mine. Like Let me that. be upset Big about difference. it, but don't retaliate against me like that. I am that customer. I am that customer who's upset because you lost my card. That's all. I'm upset because you lost a credit card, and we have to go through the process of now going and canceling it. So I'm upset and I have a right to be upset. You should at least be extremely understanding as the store who lost my credit card and let us walk out upset without telling me we aren't fond of customers like you or like that. Well, do you think Inc., that, you know, we're going to accept that what you said earlier about, you know, that they could have put it in their pocket? Of course they could have. We don't know. Happen Something happened. We're not going to steal. We have to cancel it because we don't know what we're, happened. We you are put not it in going to car. steal a customer's credit card. You could have card. given it to a wrong customer, and that customer could now be using my credit card. So we have to go take care of this issue, and it's frustrating because your store did it. That's all. Your store lost our card. All I expected was a sincere apology and to not tell us that you don't appreciate customers like that who get upset when you lose a card. Any one of these people would be upset. Would you be upset if they lost your credit card? Any customer who comes in here is yeah, going to be upset I understand that. if you lose it. But when you're, st you're stating that, you're literally stating I that said we you sold suck. it. No.